Hello everybody, today I'm taking you back to the 1800s playing a very fun game called Anno 1800. And Ubisoft invited me and my roommate to do this absolute blast of a challenge where we battle it out. And the structure of the challenge was we play this game, we build up our city or town or whatever you want to call it for three hours and then we declare war and go head to head. And two of you guys are actually helping both of us. Winner takes home a thousand dollars. So, I'm going to give you the rundown. I was curious how I wanted to structure this video, and I thought, um, obviously a three-hour video would be obviously way too much. So, played it, cut it up, going to explain exactly to you guys what goes down, alrighty? Uh, first and foremost, got to start out with the basics, and then uh, once you put your buildings down, you actually want to link everything up with roads. So, your workers can go bop to bop, do their thing. And, um, like I said... I encourage you guys to try this game for yourself. I had an absolute blast in the past playing it. So, that's blast in the past, get it, 1800. Okay. A anyways, um, everything you need is going to be in the top of the description. And uh, now, at this point in the game, I'm waiting for my econ to farm up a bit. Give it a moment. And we're going to skip one hour past my building process. And you guys are going to see the progression that takes place. Where, um, just the lead up to the giant battle that we have. I am a huge, huge fan of um, the town building portion of it. I absolutely eat those games up. Oh my goodness. As you can see, I'm building more and things are getting huge. We're an hour in. You can see at the top right um, the time. Uh, we have two hours left to do the best we possibly can and make as much money as we can to buy as many ships as we can for the all-out battle. And like I said, this is right up my alley. Professor Akali, the one we're about to battle, we'll bring him in here in a second. He is all about battling. Oh my goodness. I just love building. Building, battling. Okay? If, if, if we combine teams <coughs> or combine forces, it would have been amazing. But we'll speed it up some more. An hour left till battle time. And you can see, my town is coming together. Okay? I'm in a little bit of debt right now. But... You gotta spend money to make money. I'm working on getting as many ships prepped and ready as I possibly can. And uh, it's almost battle time. It is almost battle time. I'm gonna go grab my roommate so we can head to head commentate this battle because it was actually the closest thing you could possibly imagine. Alrighty, we'll speed it up some more. And it's go time, baby. It is go time. All right, let me go grab him. Here he is. Let's do this. All right, now um, we got to go declare war so we can actually battle against each other, which is very nice because obviously um, sometimes you don't want to go to war. You don't want to lose every troop you have. So you don't get bombarded by people way higher level than you and you just lose everything. That's not the most fun. So obviously um, the winner and myself declare war against him and his teammate. And like I said, we already know the result because uh, we had to condense this down into 10 minutes. But, no spoilers, you're going to watch the fight and you're going to love it, okay? It's it's going to be dope. It is it is close. Oh, Kevin, how, how, what was your strategy behind uh, building up your econ? Because my econ was pretty solid. And from what I've seen on your side of things after looking at it, I blew you out of the water. But this sly dog comes up with the most... I don't even, you, you guys will see it, okay, we're, we're declaring war now, uh, you guys will see it in the video, the tactic that him and his teammate use, I, I wanted to cry after I realized what kind of situation I got myself into, but uh, now we're declaring war, and like I said, this is very nice in terms of, uh, you can even get allies, trade rights, peace, it's wartime baby, it is wartime, here's my whole army, and I'm constructing it over to him. I actually go over to his base because I was like, Kevin, it's go time. It's go time. I said, find my base, mom. I need to build my base, mom. Oh, my goodness. And here we go. We're battling out. Um, the battle mechanics in this game are quite fun. I don't know if you guys have played any ship games. Uh, if you click, you'll actually travel faster. But once you turn to the right and start war zone, you can only shoot if your ship is turned to the right. Like I said, I don't know if you guys are big warship fans or whatnot. Um... But that was a notification that we are in full-out war right now. And this is where I get super pissed off. This little <laughs> freaking turret right there. This guy, dude. This guy and his teammate actually cheesed me. I'm, I'm a genius. <laughs> I'm a cheese genius. He's a cheese genius, he says. But all, all my ships are lined up in the perfect spot to get the uh, perfect artillery off. And I swear to God, th this turret, it doesn't seem like much. Right there... Very small thing, canning, cannoning all my ships. Without that, 
It would have been a complete wipeout, and uh, like I said, it might look like I was going to get the victory right off the bat because of how many ships I had, because of all the econ I generated from the farms. Dude, I wish I could just go to your farm and just talk some smack, because his it, it was not so hot, but his teammate was a god at this game, dude. A literal god. This turret's just super clutch, the little cannon turret. <laughs> he loves his little cannon turret. So my, my ships are going down. I actually start bombarding his... Uh, his base on the ocean there. I think the challenge was actually for us to meet up in the middle of an ocean in battle. But like I said, I got a little impatient. I said, screw it, and just went straight towards his base. I like how I'm bombing your freaking... <laughs> Without these cannon turrets on his base, I think it would have been a blowout. But, I mean, maybe this was his plan all along. Pissing me off to have him go chase him. I didn't think you would miss it. <laughs> <laughs> Probably should have done a little scout recon before I went full on aggro, but... If you guys want to play with your friends and go to war, this is the game to do it. And like I said, I'm all about... I, I honestly enjoyed um, the whole build-up process more than the actual going to war. But this guy was like, <laughs> Bunce, I'm ready to put you in the dirt. He didn't care so much for the econ part. Uh, so, I mean... War is in my blood. <laughs> this game kind of fits everyone's uh, spiel and what they're looking for. And... Um, the PvE and the PvP. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Uh, when, when Econ comes into play and you have to... Like I said, I went in debt so hard, but as you noticed, I had so many ships in the beginning of that fight. It's because I did some weird strategy that I don't quite recommend. But a lot of my ships have died to this point. Things are very close. He's trying to book it on out of here. So, I'm running him down, and like I said... I'm running straight towards him. I don't want to go in attack mode yet, because going in attack mode will actually slow me down. There we go. This is so close. Now I'm in attack mode. It wasn't in range. I, I'm, I'm literally hunting him down, bro. <laughs> oh, my goodness. But, like I said, everything is in the top of the description if you guys want to give this game a try. And uh, the fight... Oh, my God, dude. You... Oh, my... Die, please! <laughs> oh, my goodness, man. And then... Troop McGee over here, dude, his teammate actually carried him so hard. Okay. This flagship, this is the ship you start out with, and this is a freighter. The one where you, uh, it's the most late game ship you can buy. It's the best one. Well, second best compared to the flagship you start out with. You can get some dope upgrades, though, and, uh, we're going all out war right now. I need to turn sideways to start firing fast, and then, uh, you you'll see how things come out to play near the end. It's... <laughs> It's spicy. The uh, mini map's bottom left. If you guys are confused on which part of the map we are, I'm over here thinking, "Oh my god, I need to buy more ships fast." <laughs> we literally kind of stretched the rules on the challenge a little bit, but uh, both the people we were playing with, uh, they were just genuinely happy they got a chance to play with us, and they had a blast playing this game. And I think you guys honestly will as well. Um, like I said, we kind of took the rules and bent them a little bit. We we're Look supposed to go in the middle of the ocean. I'm over here getting blasted, but you see, I. Poop a shit out of poop a ship. Whoa, 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 whoa. Poop a ship out of my. <laughs> you, you do that sometimes, though. It's just, it's just it's nature. <laughs> oh my goodness. And this fight is so scuffed near the end. I absolutely love it. We were literally cracking up in comms so hard. Oh my goodness. That little turd, dude, I'm literally highlighting it over it, raging to him about this turd at this current point in time. I'm literally screaming, why is this turd here? But uh, I hope you guys liked the formatting of this video. I really thought showcasing um, the three-hour build-up process and showing the progression of my city to you guys was really cool. And I I'm, I'm hauling this ship to the battle zone right now. <laughs> and then uh, things are going to conclude very soon. You guys are going to see what the heck happens, already. You know, I cannot believe... If I just fought in the middle of the ocean, things would have been totally different. I'm still salty about it. I hate you. I love you too. And, and he's even getting me sick in person too. This is just a lose-lose situation here. You made me sick with how poorly you played this game. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Dude, honestly, if we were on the same team where if I had your battle strategy and you had my econ farm mechanics... Oh my goodness, dude. We should go rematch the people maybe, we played yeah, with. Maybe we should do a 2v2 versus viewers. They comment down below their name. I'd be down for that. I'd be down for that. Anno 1800... 2v2 against us. We're going to go out of our way to play against you guys because we genuinely had a blast playing this game. Um, the people we played with, like I said, that was like Bunce. That was more fun than freaking League. I literally had so much of a blast. But um, as you can see, the battle is 
beyond scuffed at this point, and the, <laughs> the ending is literally meme-tastic, okay? <laughs> it's gonna showcase in about one minute, but we're literally straggling. We lost so many of our initial ships in that first giant battle around his home base slash turret, and uh, we're literally straggling all we have left to come to a final conclusion on this battle, and it's it's pretty meme-tastic. Everyone's coming together, and oh my goodness, but like, uh, like Kevin said, Comment down below your Anno 1800 name. I recommend you guys try this. I am a strong believer you enjoy it as well. Whether if it's uh, you guys like the battle portion, you guys like working together. Um, it has all aspects in a game that you want, and it's just a whole lot of fun. Oh, man. This is this is the final. Here it comes. This is the final shebang, boys. Oh, goodness. <laughs> it's literally right around this little island. The comms got hypey, dude. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm not gonna say who won, but you might be able to tell from my tone of voice that things might have not gone my way, but... No no spoilers, okay? No spoilers. No, none. None. You wanna give a little hint on what happens here? I win. No, no, no! <laughs> That's not the hint I want! <laughs> oh my goodness. This little island, dude, I'm sending my last two troops the bop these oh my goodness okay so he's getting low i'm getting bombarded my ship goes down that other ship goes down dude the literally the bullets in the air of the dying ship killed that one now it's a 1v1 down here and i have this guy bombing who knows what down there i'm trying to get him to the fight as fast as i possibly can but this ship is so strong it might not look that strong but it is strong once you guys really start playing the game, you'll realize the different strengths and weaknesses in each ship, and they go in depth. It is so, so cool to see, and like I said, I'm hauling this guy up here to join the final battle, and uh, I get a little plot twist near the end of here. I think this is the last guy, and like I said, the ending fight is meme-tastic, dude. Oh my goodness. And as I come to the fight, like we said, um, we're going to go out of our way to play with two of you guys, so comment your names down below. And if, if you want to be on the winning team, hey, I'm your guy, okay? I swear to God, this guy got carried in his in in, in this game, but I still had a blast with my teammate. It was fun. It was fun. What the hell? There it is, dude. There it is. It's a 2v1 <laughs> situation. I'm totally caught off guard. This is the last guy. These are the final three ships in the battle, and it, it goes down, okay? It goes down. I'm thinking he's weak over there because little puny little ship. I got a freaking... <laughs> Godlike pirate ship over here, and I go down. They're literally both at one HP. I go down too. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Actually insane. But like I said, um, we're gonna play with some of you guys. We had an absolute blast. I know you guys will like Anno eighteen hundred. Everything's in the top of the description. And thank you so much to Anno eighteen hundred for sponsoring this video. Kevin, what are you gonna say to your future teammate? The next one that is. Oh, I was gonna say to, to this one. You're welcome for a thousand dollars. But uh, to the future one. I mean, we're play if we're playing against you, it's fine. We don't need help. <laughs> Any future teammate, please just be half decent. That's all we need to be, buddy. <laughs> no, just please carry the heck out of him. That's the only way he's going to win. We'll have a blast oh, playing again as well. But hopefully we'll see yeah. you guys tomorrow because we upload every single day. Peace, peace.